So here we are, two days after I did a 10K, my legs are really sore. I need to get a recovery run in today, but I'm not sure that my legs are ready for all the pounding. And now, lucky for us, Team of Autos just made a, a partnership with Lightspeed Running. And Lightspeed Running is a uh, non-weight bearing system that you can use on your own treadmill. Let me just show you a little bit about how it works. First off, you just take a pair of these shorts. It's just a pair of uh, like a thicker neoprene short with some Velcro. That's what they look like. This is what they look like on. They look from a distance like normal shorts, but it's basically just a little uh, Velcro short. So these are totally Luna approved, as you always have to know. But uh, we're going to head down to the garage, and I'll show you how to strap yourself uh, into these shorts and onto the treadmill. Okay, so here we are in the garage. This is our Woodway treadmill. This works with any treadmill, the light speed system. Basically, you got this frame, these four posts. Underneath, there's a connector. But you've got these four posts. As you can see right now, I have it set it up just for regular use. But it's just as simple as this. Uh, you take these little pieces here, and you just clip it on to the height that you need. I happen to know that for my height, I have to go on the second. But I'll show you how to measure it in a second. It's a pretty cool little thing. And so how much how much weight does that take off of your body weight when you put it there? Well, when you start at this level, which is um, my proper level, the highest, it takes 30 pounds off. Um, which is pretty significant. If you go down a notch, it takes another four pounds. So basically, this notch for me would be 26 pounds and 22 pounds and so forth all the way down. At this point, um, I'm at, uh, what I say, 30 pounds. So basically, um, that's how you set this up. And then the next step, I'm going to show you how to strap yourself into the harness. And then we'll connect and we'll get a demo of the run. So basically you take this strap, you're going to find your greater trochanter, which is just here, from the hip bone you come down and it's sort of that bony part that sticks out. You're going to basically go just under that. And this attaches with Velcro. Leave that part up. Take one of these straps and basically this goes under here just for a little extra, a little extra Velcro closure. You pull this tight around here like that. And that's basically all you need to do. You're strapped in at that point. And then you want to go to the other side and do that one. So now you've got it in, uh, you're strapped in, you've got the framework that's already assembled. You just step into your treadmill. And to make sure you've got your uh, straps in the proper place, you take this handy measuring stick uh, with the magnets, clip it on there. This just gives you the 12 inch height. Um, pretty genius little uh, simple technique, but basically that should hang to um, to right about this point. It shows you that you've got it at the proper height. So that's 12 inches. Uh, that's there for later. Best thing to do is clip yourself in to the back first. It's a little easier um, to do with the front last. So once you have the back in, step forward. You can pull yourself up, clip it like that. It just goes right in. Flip this side. You'll sort of start to feel like it's lifting you up a bit at this point. But that's as simple as it is. So all you need to do now is, uh, for me, I've got the Woodway already fired up. I'm put this up at 3%. Um, no slacking here in the Team Lovato garage. And then basically, you just ramp it up and you start running. Uh, one of the things you're going to notice when I start out is there's a lot of freedom. So uh, you, you can have this sort of lateral movement without... Uh, being restricted by anything around your waist. Uh, you just really feel kind of normal. Um, and then the other kind of nice little perk, those of you that run on treadmills, you're often focusing on forward, the machine, the mirror, whatever it is, so that you don't shoot off the back. You can't look at the TV, you can't look around, um, just because you may lose orientation and step off. Uh, but this one keeps you in place. So you'll see when I'm going, I could be running along and... Um, and not even look where I'm going. Just an extra perk. The real perk of this machine, though, is that you're running with 30% less body weight. Right now, just as a warm-up, I'm already going a little bit faster than I normally would. All you feel is a tiny bit of pressure on the outside of your hips. Almost like fingers are there. You made a warm-up, I think I'm... My pace is. At 653, it's pretty easy. You can really bring the speed up.
Anything else, Michael? That's it.